Now we'll see, we'll start a new chapter that is trigonometry, unit 7. And uh, in this 5 mark problems, we'll see now. Now listen carefully, model paper 1. These are all some important questions. A vertical tree is broken by the wind and the top of the tree touches the ground and makes an angle of 30 degrees with it. Now, if the top of the tree touches the ground 30 meters away from its foot, then find the actual height of the tree. That means, first of all, you should understand the problem clearly and you should draw the diagram correctly. Otherwise, you will get a wrong answer. Now, there is a tree is there. Now, listen here. This is after broken part. This is the diagram. Before that, it is like this. B, A. Now, this is the top part. So, due to the wind, this part is bended down. That means, it is fell down like this. So, it fell down. This is a point C. We do not know at what part it is fell down and it is touches the ground. That means, first initial position is like this. Now, this top part bend it like this. Okay. So, this is making an angle of 30 degrees with this uh, ground. So, B is the ground, ground part of the tree. That means, it touches the tree. The tree is such as the ground at point B like this. So, this is point A. Now, it is bended like this. So, this is I am putting the new point C. So, this is point A. So, it is bended like this. So, this is point A, this point C. So, now this is making an angle of 30 degrees with the ground like this. That is the bended part. So, what they are asking is, what is the height of the tree? That means, full height I required. That means, full height means what? This is the initial part. This is initial part and this is bended part. That means, what? I need BC and also AC. So, if you add these two parts, I will get total height of the tree. So, two things I need to find out in this triangle. What are the things means? BC side B C I need to find and also this hypotenuse A C also I should find. So, that total height becomes B C plus A C. So, I have to add up B C and also A C. Now, listen carefully in right angle triangle right angle triangle A C D. A C, A C B or A B C, whatever it may be, that does not matter. Why right angle triangle? Here angle is 90 degrees. That is why right angle triangle. Now, you apply tan 30 because tan 30, tan 30 opposite side by adjacent side. So, B C you will get. So, tan 30 is equal to or first tan theta, tan A you can write otherwise tan 30 is equal to B C by 30. So, now what is tan 30? 1 by root 3. So, 1 by root 3 is equal to B C by 30. Now, cross multiply. Root 3 into B C is equal to 30. Now, what is B C? 30 by root 3 or you can rationalize like this. Root 3, root 3 you multiply both numerator and denominator. So, that numerator becomes 30 root 3, denominator becomes 3. So, 3 1s, 3 10s. So, 10 root 3. That means what? This part is 10 root 3 you got. So, what about this part? That part also have to do. So, for that what you will do? Either you can take cos theta or sin theta. Once you know this value, sin you can take or cos also you can take. Now, cos 30 is equal to, cos 30 degrees is equal to adjacent side. This is adjacent side. This is hypotenuse. So, adjacent side is AB. Hypotenuse is AC. Now, cos 30, what is the value of cos 30? Root 3 by 2. Because sin 30, 1 by 2. Cos 30, root 3 by 2. Is equal to AB. AB value 30. Because that is the length at which tree touches the point A by A C, we do not know that you have to find. Now, cross multiply A C into root 3 is equal to 60 because 2 into 30. Now, what is A C? 60 divided by root 3. Again, you rationalize 60 into root 3 by root 3 into root 3. 
Rationalize means you have to get rid of root in the denominator part. For that purpose, you multiply with root 3 at both numerator and denominator. Now, it becomes what? 60 root 3 by 3. So, 20 root 3. So, this part is 20 root 3. So, now can you tell what is the total height of the tree now? Nothing but BC plus AC. Therefore, see, find the actual height of the tree or total height of the tree. Now, actual height of tree, actual height of tree is equal to this part and bended part. So, BC plus AC. Now, what is BC you got? 10 root 3 plus AC you got 20 root 3. So, root 3 you take common 10 plus 20, 30. So, it becomes 30 root 3. That is your answer because book answer itself 30 root 3 meter. If you want root 3 1.732, you can multiply. That is up to you. Even if you stop here also, they will give the mark. So, listen one more time. Here in this triangle, one, one time you take tan 30 such that you will get opposite side and one time you take cos 30 such that you will get hypotenuse. That is what we need. Opposite side plus hypotenuse will give you the total height of the tree. So, very important problem repeatedly they ask in the examination. Now, in